sir. Can I interest you in Chelonianism? Howdy, viewers. Brad, proprietor of Barstool Entertainment, not selling you Chelonialism, but doing a video about a garment set, the Night Wrangler. Now, I already have a few of the pelts needed for this set, and this is kind of the last set Arthur can get done. Otherwise, the other remaining sets will have to be completed by John. And the reason I'm completing these garment sets is the items that you acquire, like guns, garment sets, etc., will be passed along to John eventually. And plus, hunting and crafting has really kind of made it a very interesting game for me. Trying to get the garment sets, trying to get the right pelt, trying to get this and that, it's made it a very interesting game. So I'm going to show you how to get perfect pelts for the Night Wrangler. Trying to get perfect pelts is a hard thing to do. And the moose is very difficult. Over by Willard's Rest, between the railroad tracks and the river, a moose always spawns. I mean, you have to use the game saves and exploit a little bit, but you can get a perfect moose, and Arthur is creeping up on one right now, right there, western bull moose. And, yeah. Caracow rifle works wonders. And again, in this area, the bull moose more than likely will spawn and it will be perfect. Like I said, just outside, of, you know, just west of Willard's Rest and right next to the river and north of the railroad tracks. Okay, with the perfect moose pelt, I'll show you on the map here. Right here, where the player's staying, Willard's Rest, I can guarantee you uh, moose will spawn. You just got to do a little exploiting of saves and reloads, but you can get a perfect moose. Now, the next one is the perfect panther pelt. That is difficult to get, but what you can do is put a deer corpse down in a certain area. Throw some um, uh, predator bait down to sweeten the deal, and you just got to wait because the perfect panther will come out at this crossroads. You want to lure it out, and again, very easy to lure out, and once you get that perfect panther pelt, you're one step closer to the um, acquiring of the Night Wrangler set. Now, the method I used by dropping a deer, a dead deer, and throwing down some predator bait works really well. You just got to be patient. And the problem is sometimes you get ambushed by the panther. So now on to the next pelt. You'll also need two perfect coyote pelts and a perfect cougar pelt as well as a perfect wolf pelt 
Well, you can get all these almost in the same area. Right here, I'm ready to kill a coyote. And the, yep, there you go. And you can get it in the same area as you can get cougars. The wolves will show up once in a while, but you just set traps or bait or dead animals around, and eventually you'll get two coyotes, a cougar, and a wolf in the same area. And that's where the trapper usually is. And, you know, it's kind of relatively easy. Again, you got to set out some bait and some traps. But now I've got the perfect coyote pelt. I will probably need another one. But I can keep hunting for that and hopefully get a cougar as well. Now, you also need a perfect badger pelt. And there's one area I know for sure where a badger reliably spawns. It's just outside Caliglia Hall. And these crossroads, if you come riding up, what will happen is a badger will spawn. And you have to have the varmint rifle ready. And you have to shoot. You're taking your chances that it's perfect. But if you use the save and reload, you might be able to get a perfect badger pelt after a few tries. perfect badger pelt. I'm going to show you the location on the map right here, um, right outside Cliglia Hall or whatever. Uh, you can see the crossroads. A badger reliably spawns and runs across the road whenever you ride up. And again, I'll show you on the map right in this area. And now I'm going to ride back to the trapper and I should be able to have everything I need for the Night Wrangler. Now, the Night Wrangler actually requires two coyote pelt, two cougar, one black bear, one wolf, one panther, one moose, and one badger. Now, I didn't show you everything because I already had several black bear pelts and a couple cougar pelts, but the and a wolf pelt. The coyotes and the panther, the moose, and the badger, I didn't have. But those I showed you where they kind of reliably spawn. So let's get on with putting together the Night Wrangler garment. After you approach the trapper and you sell him the last pelt, which is the badger pelt, and if you have everything gathered, it doesn't matter what order you do it in, but you should be able to buy the entire set. And let's see, garment set. I'm going to go up Night Wrangler. Yep, Coyote Gambler's hat. Cougar cutaway coat. The Wilderness Vest. Yeah, I'm showing you, you can you know, what you really need, but then you have the next one is Moose Half Chops, Chaps. Again, you got to get these, you know, and you can just buy this, and you got to hunt, but now you got the Badger Rifleman's Gloves, and yep, you got the entire Night Wrangler set. It's a little work, but you can actually do it pretty quickly if you know how to trap and bait and lure the animals out. I took a little time doing it. Again, I had some other animal pelts from hunting, but this was the final set that um, Arthur can complete before John ends up needing to complete the other sets. If you found this interesting, 
hit the thumbs up button. Feel free to leave some comments. If you like this type of video, hit the subscribe button and bell icon. I post four video game related videos a week, plus some specials and some shorts, and you don't want to miss out. As always, thanks for watching, thanks for subscribing, and thanks for stopping by.